good morning children hope all are doing quite great mbbs admissions for the academic year 25 to 26 first round of seat allotment in ap and telangana and also second round of allotment at in all india quota was completed and congratulations to all the students who got admitted and who got the seat and the students who narrowly missed so children there is no need for you to worry because second round, third round and mop up rounds are there. So definitely you will be getting into the medical colleges of your choice. I think all of you might be into the festive mood and the Dasara vacation is going to commence from uh, day after tomorrow onwards. So in this vacation, we would like to give some quite an important and a quite useful error test in our digital platform that is IL Meta platform. Now, so many weekend examinations we will be conducting and there will be a purpose for every test. It may be a weekend, it may be a unit test or it may be a part test. First, let us see what is the purpose of attending a test. Now, in general, whenever there is a test, we will give some syllabus. And for that syllabus need to be prepared in a sequential order. So this is the first point that is sequential order of preparation is the one thing which is required to perform well in a test which you are going to attend. Now the second thing, exposure to exam writing experience. See children remember one thing, so many practice tests you will be writing. For what purpose? To perform well in the final test that final test will be conducted only for three hours duration. So for that three hours duration test, you are preparing for two years. So to perform extraordinarily well in that three hours of final examination is the very, very important thing. So for that, so many practice examinations we are conducting. So exam writing skills is the one thing which will determine and which will decide the your performance in the final examination. So exam writing skills need to be improved and this exam writing skills can be improved only during the examination time. So during the examination time means suppose if you take a weekend examination, so we will be conducting a test on every Monday for about three hours duration. So for that three hours duration, you are preparing for seven days. And whatever you prepare for in these seven days will be tested in that three hours. In that three hours, you need to write the exam with the best skills. So you need to develop that exam writing skills. So that exam writing skills to develop. So, so many practice examinations you need to write. That is the second thing. Now, a test is announced, syllabus is given and you are preparing in an order and you have written the test. So once a test is done, you need to check whether your preparation to that particular test is perfect or not. Then how can you check? That means based on the number of questions which are made right and based on the number of questions which are made wrong, then you can assess yourself whether you have prepared to that test perfectly or not. Next, identifying the topics or subtopics in a chapter from which you have not answered the questions. Suppose in any subtopic, some two to three questions you have not made correct. Let us assume that means you might not have the good clarity on that particular topic or subtopic. So this you will be knowing after the examination is done. Then in every examination, you will make many questions right and few questions wrong. So whatever the questions that you made wrong after the exam is done, you need to go through all the wrongly answered questions and if needed, you need to read the concept again and you need to become perfect with that question. Even you made wrong in that examination, but after the examination is done, you must become perfect with that. Once you become perfect with all the wrongly answered questions in an exam, then once we conduct a unit test after two weeks or after three weeks, so in the unit test, you can perform well in the same topic or subtopic. So this is the purpose of this attending the test. So you have written the test and after writing the test, some questions you made it wrong. And there are some wrongly answered questions which you can recollect. 
just by looking at the key sheet and some wrongly answered questions you can become perfect after listening to the lecturer after the exam is done but there will be some wrongly answered questions which needs much practice and even though you are thorough with that particular question on the day you may or may not recollect with that question once a unit test is conducted or part test is conducted or final test is conducted that means these are called the most difficult questions which made wrong by the majority of the students that means the common errors so these common errors are very very important to a student of any stream or any year like junior inter senior inter or long term so to help the students especially in this kind of common errors we have designed a program in this dasara vacation that program is the conducting error tests in the common mistakes committed by the students in our digital platform that is infinity learn meta app so for juniors for seniors as well as to the long term students we are conducting error tests and we are giving a schedule then how this error error questions are identified now see after conducting a test we will see the analysis of the almost all the students so the questions which are made wrong by maximum percentage of students in that particular stream so all such questions we will consider as more difficult questions so that more difficult questions we are giving in the form of a test called error test so all the examinations which we have conducted to juniors seniors and long terms in this year right from the beginning till the date so in all these tests we have identified most common error questions or in another way most difficult questions in the all these examinations now take for example junior stream maybe junior elite junior aims or junior mpl whatever be the junior stream so we have collected all these common errors happened in all the tests conducted in the first year right from the beginning till now now let us assume that we have collected around some 200 questions that 200 questions as it is we have taken that means the way we have conducted it in as a test the same question we have taken and we have prepared some question that means almost all the same 200 questions similar to the question which made wrong by the student that means for example junior inter stream ganaka teesukunnattu avute oka 200 error questions correct ayine ankonde so inko oka 200 questions similar to that that means essence of the question will remain the same but numbers will change or in the case of theoretical question some concept koncham statements kuda mari payintayi so we have identified error questions and also we have made questions similar to error questions so error questions and similar to error questions we are conducting in the form of a test and we are discussing now i will discuss you the schedule of that error test stream wise now take for example junior inter for all the junior stream that means a junior elite junior aims junior mpl and junior medicon to all the streams we are conducting this error test starting from 28th september to 4th october 28th september to 4th october children listen carefully on the 28th september junior inter botany error test 1 how many questions 30 questions so as this botany zoology questions can be answered in little bit less time the time given to that particular test is 20 minutes and end date is 6th october see as you are in the vacation if ever we give some particular time so in that time you may or may not write so that is the reason this botany error test 1 you can attempt starting from 6 am on 28th september 2025 to 6th october up to 10 pm we have given the flexibility but children don't try to postpone this that means i suggest you to take this test on the same day maybe at 6 am maybe at 9 am maybe at 12 or maybe at 2 pm or 3 pm but whatever it may be the test that are scheduled for 28th september need to be attended on the 28th only it is more suggestible and more advisable then now if you take the junior inter physics error test one on the same day 
that means how many questions 30 questions as the numericals are involved in it the time given to answer such questions is 45 and if you take the chemistry error test 1 30 questions and 30 minutes a time is given so children here every day we are conducting three tests and every test will have 30 questions from this 30 15 are the questions which you made wrong the remaining 15 are similar to the questions which you made wrong so the same 15 questions we are giving and the remaining 15 questions which are similar to the errors which you have committed we have given now similarly on the 29th and first second third fourth now on the first october on the first october we are conducting an all india test series program that means sri chaitanya is conducting neat all india test series to the students of sri chaitanya throughout the country so this is the very very important test so already we circulated the syllabus of this all india test series to your whatsapp groups you might have gone through that then and that test we are conducting on the first october and children remember the time for this all india test series is fixed the time for errors test is not fixed but for this time for this all india test series exam is fixed the time is first october and 2 pm to 5 pm only only in that specified time you must take the test so after this neat all india test series 2 then from the 2nd october 3rd october 4th october again we are conducting this error test now children it is more suggestible and more advisable for you to attend this error test in this vacation if you complete all these error test that means the purpose of writing the test right from the beginning to till this 27th october will be served because in those question in those examinations many questions you made right and you made wrong with some questions so that questions again you are practicing is it clear children so all the junior inter students exam these kuntunnar kada all these error tests so all these error tests you just take on the stipulated uh, date and after the test is done it will give some kind of analysis and you just go through the that analysis is it clear children yes now let us see senior inter now for senior inters we have conducted more examinations because that is from april to september so as we have conducted more tests the number of error questions are also more so it is all together we are conducting around 900 questions in the form of this error test in this 900 450 are the errors and the remaining 450 are the questions similar to that errors is it clear children now again on the same 28th so 28th 29th 30 and on the first october even to the senior inter students we are conducting sri chaitanya's neat all india test series and the syllabus of this test is also circulated to your classrooms and again go through that syllabus and on the first october i suggest every second year student to take the test and this test has a fixed duration test that means it is only three hours and the date is the first october and the time of the test is 2 pm to 5 pm only is it clear children then then again second october third october fourth october fifth october so we are conducting the test and these are the number of questions and the time uh, depending upon the subject the time allotted is different is it clear children next similarly come to the long term so for long term also that means a repeaters batch also we have picked out most common errors and we made questions similar to that errors and to the long term stream also we are conducting the test so on the 28th september to 4th october and even to the long term students this sri chaitanya neat all india test series will be conducted and the test date is 1st october and the test time is 2 pm to 5 pm is it clear children now see children once again uh, i suggest each one of you 
that means junior inter students senior inter students and also long term students we suggest you to take all these error test compulsorily definitely it will increase your uh, conceptual base and it will increase your confidence and it will definitely make you to get more marks in the upcoming test okay children this uh, error test during this uh, vacation time is very very useful and it is perfectly planned so as per the schedule that was given please take the test compulsorily okay nana so thank you thank you all